Chad Colby from the National Farm Machinery Show. I'm in the Degelman booth with their pro till, and I've got to tell you, I've been looking forward to stopping by all day and hoping I could catch this guy. Paul, great to take a few minutes and talk to you about the farm show. Yeah, well, thanks for stopping. You've got uh, you got a lot going on here, friend. We have, uh, yeah, we have the, yeah, we got we got Kinsey as a partner. Uh, pro till is, you know, the pro till is just being so successful. We are completely out of out of capacity. We we need help. So. so Let's clear some things up. I was all over right. visiting with Susie today. We're a longtime yeah. user of Kinsey. Yeah. Um, Kinsey did not buy Degelman. So everybody no. that thinks that happened, no. they didn't. They licensed yeah. the product. And we didn't buy Kinsey. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. We got the work out of the yeah. way. Let's talk about the Degelman a little bit. Yeah. I personally have had a chance to run this machine now two years. Yeah. Um, really impressed with the fall package. It's unlike anything I've run. But I will tell you, I'm probably almost more excited about the potential in the spring. What can you share about that as far as how we use it in central Illinois? Well, you I tell you what, I'm a I'm from I'm from Western Canada. These these machines, we actually designed it for the Corn Belt. Yeah. And we never got a chance to actually get down here until just a few years ago. So what what we started doing in, in Western Canada was fixing fields. We had uh, sprayer ruts and combine ruts. Yep. We had sloughs growing out, headlands growing in, and our fields were a mess. So a pro-till was the perfect tool to fix all these fields. In the Corn Belt, I don't know a whole lot, which kind of brings me to <laughs> why we partnered with Kinsey. Yeah. Kinsey have been in the business, same kind of vintage as, as we are. They are, they're quality people. They've been building their planters for years and years. Um, and we really needed help in this area. So uh, Kinsey is gonna be that arm that, that will uh, that will market in in the in these areas and tell us what we need, what we don't need, and and how we go forward. You know, Paul, the biggest thing I, I enjoy about speaking with you is you're a farmer too. Yeah. And you know what? That means a lot. <laughs> I don't know if I'm a grain farmer, but I'm a farmer. <laughs> My brother and I are farming, and awesome. uh, and and that's that's probably the, the the biggest joy that we have in our business is being a, be able to go out and and run some of this equipment and 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 we're trying different things and. And uh, yeah, we're experimenting and, and we're finding a little bit of success. And uh, yeah, we love it. Our, you know, our, our, my, my father, he founded the company. He was a farmer. Awesome. Uh, the old story at, at Dagelman is he chased the cows out of the barn and started building a rock picker. And uh, <laughs> this is where we are 55 years later, wow. uh, building some real rugged, um, awesome design stuff that really performs in the field. And, and yeah, that's our roots, and that's hey, that's you know it, we it were, all works. We were talking a little bit off air, you know, maintenance. You've thought about a lot of things on this machine. I've had the ability yeah. to test a lot of different yeah. one pass machines. The issue yeah. we run into is when you've got corn yields in in the Midwest consistently now getting out in the high 200s and 300s. We got to manage residue, and your tool does an amazing job, yeah. and you've got yeah. an amazing support staff. Yeah. Yeah. I would encourage Thank anyone. You. If you haven't seen one of these run in a field, find a phone, find the internet, and and get out there. And whether it's blue or yeah, yellow, get one yeah, out and try it. They, and I tell you what, the, it's a it's a major investment in your in your operation. Uh, the the reason that we're successful with Pro Till is that we are willing to put that machine on 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 that farmer's tractor in his field, and we wouldn't ask for that sale unless it was it was done that way and. And uh, they can they can see how it works in their field, and I think they're going to be impressed with it. Uh, we're trying to think of everything that <laughs> that we can to, to to give that farmer a good experience, and so he sees some some real value. Right. And uh, this machine here, uh, as an example, it's our new generation Pro Till. Right. Well, there you won't find a grease nipple on it. So right. we've we've done zero grease technology, which we are doing a fantastic job of tight tolerances and sealing everything off. And uh, and we're trying to build a generational machine, so this thing stays on the farm for 30 you know, years. The one thing I liked when I was doing my research of whether this was going to be a product that I was comfortable in retailing in our in our business, which is 120 years old, so it's not our first day. Well, and when I talked to producers that had 8,000 acres, 12,000 acres, 15,000 acres, and they would say, uh, Chad, we've done nothing to it. Yeah. We've washed it. Yeah. We've done nothing. We're a little nervous, yeah. but it just no. works. I tell you what, our guys, they did a nice job, and we build everything heavy enough, and we're not. That's a, wait a we, minute. Hey, That's an understatement. Well, okay? I know. We're, we're the overbuild guys. <laughs> but uh, we, hey, we, we want you just to put the pin in this thing from your tractor and go 
Farmer's got enough to worry about. He's got combines and tractors and electronics to worry about. We keep things nice and simple, straightforward, yep. and we make sure that they stay they stay running. And that's 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 the goal. Well, listen, enjoy the National Farm Machinery Show. Yeah, yeah. I trust that the next five or ten years, you're going to remember this one because it's the one that's the first one with Kinsey. And listen, yeah. that's a big deal. Yeah. Uh, I know the folks at Kinsey very well, and they're they're pretty proud yeah, of this yeah. too. So. Well, if they think it's good, that's a feather in our cap, yep. and uh, we're going to do everything we can to help them be successful with it. And, and I'm glad they have it. They're good people, and, and we're, we're happy with the partnership. Thanks, Paul. Thank you. You bet. All right.